Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. But I knew, I, I listened to a couple of y'all episodes with uh, Bishop yeah. the Eli. Mm -hmm. Is that him? Yeah. That was a good episode. I like yeah, that episode yeah, too. I like that. One. But because yeah, he talked about his transformation and he did. Mm -hmm. How many years did he do? 40? He did like 38? 30 years, I think. Was it 38 or 30? 30. I think it's 30. 30. Mhm. Mm um in total in total you did like what? 28? 28. 28. I did 18 years flat. I did 10 years free. Mhm. Mm okay. all papers and everything. I done did everything. Yeah, yeah. So what made you not go back? What made you not get back, get in trouble again? What because when you come back out, we've always talked about yeah, this, but he's older that now people, too. No, though. but people, but people I'm talking mature. people knew who you were, and when you come out, and they gonna come to you and try to offer you, man, you know, it I happened. got this. The, how it comes you didn't go back? It happened because I came home with a different mindset. I got an opportunity to hug my mom and dad. You did, yeah. When I, I came home, you that. I hugged my mom and daddy, right? Lucky for you because a lot yes. of people lost their mom and dad exactly. while they were gone. They lost them. Mm -hmm. And I seen guys that, hey, man, yeah. now nah, I'm good. I'm all right. I'm chill. I'm good. I was, I put myself away for a minute before I even came out and really started communicating with, with people, people in the hood. I put myself up. Cause I was on a mission. My nephew was at this electrical company. I started working before the new Parkland that's been that, that's built now. Mm -hmm. I worked at Parkland when it was straight dirt. Mm. Okay. We ran all the electrical for Parkland mm -hmm. when it was all dirt. The big panels. I worked right there. You see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. When they finished that job, you know what got me was when they finished that job. And they told me, uh, you know, they, I had to, you had to go back and go through it. But my background, because mm -hmm. I probably working at Parkland Hospital now, happening in with the electrical. But whenever you go for a hospital, they got to do a thorough background, background check. Background check. And when they found out. They found, so what happened was the dude was telling me like, man, don't worry about that. I got you. I'm going to make sure you, so I'm like, all right, bet. So go ahead and go through with it. Man. Came back like man, ain't nothing we can do. Boom! That was that was my first that was my first knockdown. Now that, mm -hmm. that hurt. That was my first. Did it hurt? Knock yeah, that hurt. You gotta realize I'm I'm fresh out. I'm doing electrical work. I'm making like twenty five dollars an hour. Killing it. Come on, man. I'm talking about, and all I'm doing is running. Man, I'm running wide. Just man, I'm talking about. <coughs> every week we getting a check. Come on, man. I'm talking about like, yeah. And it's and legal. And now, they finna tell me, I'm finna work at the Parkland Hospital, and they told me how they how we're gonna be doing it. All I was gonna be doing is making sure, checking the, making sure that the, uh, everything was right. If some break down inside the main thing, we'll just go in. So I'm like, oh man, this is it, man. Ooh. So to, to get that, that kind of, that hurt. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You see what I'm saying? So now I'm going back to, Man, what I'm finna do, bro? Other jobs talking about ten dollars an hour. I went from making twenty five dollars an hour to you telling me ten dollars an hour. How long did that go on for? Before you actually got a stable job? Man, I, I'm when I when I did when when I left the. Uh, I'm gonna be honest with you. When I left the. Uh, I had to make something happen. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101.